Hi, everyone. So I'm going to talk through dialogue and colon quotes. Um, so remember that both of them have punctuation, right? Like a flow quote does not have punctuation, but dialogue quotes, you have a comma to introduce your quote. And for colon quotes, you have, of course, a colon to introduce your quotes. Um, they both start with a capital letter. So the quote should start with a capital letter um, because it's, you know, the remainder of the sentence will be the quote. The difference between them is that a dialogue quote comes after a she said, he said, they said, which is not a complete sentence. So a shima reflects what, right? You couldn't just put a period there and be done. Um, a colon comes after a full sentence. So a shima reflects on the American tradition of giving birth in a hospital. If you put a period there, that would stand on its own. Okay, so that's kind of the main difference between them. One of them, the dialogue quote does not come after a full sentence. A colon quote does come after a full sentence. So let's look at the practice. Remember that the checkpoint is here at the end. I would do some of this practice first to make sure that you're successful at the checkpoint so you're not just guessing, um, but that's up to you. So we're gonna look at, is the quote introduced by a complete thought? Remember that if you click this lesson, it will give you some hints as well, specific to no red ink. You should be clicking practice. I'm clicking quiz me because I already did the practice. All right, um, so we have to decide, is this complete or not? Eleanor Young asked me to sit down before she shared the bad news. So if I put a period there, that's a complete thought. Fiance admitted that she could use some help. Again, if I put a period there, that's a complete thought. Astrid Young Tio nervously asked the wizard. If we, if we stop there, it's not, it's not a complete thought, right? Like, what does she ask? Plus, we have a comma here, and that's kind of an easy hint, right? If it has a colon, you know it's a complete thought. If it has a comma, you know it's an incomplete thought. Max Mayfield clapped her hands and declared, what does she declare, right? We need the rest of the sentence. So that's incomplete, plus it has a comma, which tells us that it's incomplete, okay? So that's pretty straightforward. Um, you just have to decide if it's complete or not. Um, and then the next part of it will be formatting dialogue and colon. So you'll have to actually go through and um, fix the punctuation, the capitalization. So you start the same way. Kanye West was shocked when he entered a surprise party. So is that a complete thought or not? Yes, if we put a period there, that would be complete. Um, so we know this is gonna be a colon quote. So I'm gonna put a colon here. I'm gonna make sure it's capital, it is, and submit. Ascot Fitzgerald told the detective, is that a complete thought? It's not, because we don't know what he told. So that's a dialogue quote. Um, that means we're gonna keep our comma, make sure this is capitalized. Ama made her proposal to the entire water polo team. That's a complete thought, right? We could end the sentence there. So I'm gonna keep the colon, make sure it's capitalized. The tourist asked George R. R. Martin for directions. That could be a complete thought, right? We could put a period there. So I know that's a colon quote, so I'm gonna put a colon in. I also have to make sure that this is capitalized. For this one, it's always gonna be capitalized. So when you are done with that, um, the last thing is, of course, the checkpoint, which is going to mix all of those together. So you have to be really tricky to make sure, you know, you have to check to see, is it a full sentence? And then if it is, you, you're going to use a colon. If it's not, you have to figure out if it's a flow or a dialogue quote um, to figure out if you need a comma or not. So Nicki Minaj stopped watching television because, so not a full thought. I can't use a colon there. So then the question is, is it a flow quote or a dialogue quote? In this case, um, we don't have a she said, he said, they said, so it can't be a dialogue quote. So it's a flow quote. So Nicki Minaj stopped watching television because there aren't any good TV shows on, on anymore. So that all flows together. So that means I don't need any punctuation and this letter should not be capitalized, okay? 
So that's going to be pretty tricky to do them all together, but that's really good practice because that's what you all have to do in your writing is, is be able to, you know, use all three of those types of quotes and punctuate them correctly. Um, so take your time on it. If you feel like you're getting stuck, please come see me. Um, we can go through some of them together. Okay. All right. Thanks everyone.